Mohamed Nazifuddin Najib made his father, Prime Minister Datuk Sri Mohamed Najib Tun Razak proud by becoming the new Vice President of the Olympic Council of Malaysia, OCM. The second son of the Prime Minister, who is the Deputy President of Malaysian Taekwondo Association, garnered the most number of votes among the nine candidates fighting for five Vice Presidents' posts. Nazifuddin, who was contesting for the first time for the OCM post, received 75 votes of the 104 eligible voters. I think, as a young person, this is a sign that we need to have the support of young people and their support in the team. I hope I can bring the young people to the young people and I hope I can bring the new ideas and also the issues that young people are facing in the team of our country. The other elected vice presidents are Datuk Ong Po Eng, Datuk Zakaria Ahmad, Datuk Megat Zulkarnain Omar Din, and Datuk Paduka Mumtaz Jafar. Incumbent Tan Sri Tunku Imran Tuanku Jafar, who has been OCM president since 1998, retained his post by beating Tan Sri Muhammad Anwar Muhammad Noor. Tunku Imran wants the new office bearers elected for 2015 to 2017 term to work as a team in preparation for the 2017 Kuala Lumpur Sea Games. No, let's not ever have this standing as a team business. It's not part of sport. That's politics. And we don't want to uh, have in the future, um, you know, manifestos which talk about money. I think that's wrong as well. The manifestos should not be about money and there should really not be any, any manifestos. Despite the intense campaign, Tunku Imran says he is happy the elections went smoothly.